Good morning you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back at the Pismo Preserve hiking trails and today I'm going to be doing the Lone Oak hike which is 2.2 miles. Odie came along with me today. It's just me and him today. So last time I was here, or the last two times I was here, I followed the blue arrow to the spring to spring. That's a 3.4 mile. Today I'm going to follow the red arrow, which is the Lone Oak, and that's a 2.2, I believe, 2.2 mile hike. And I'm already out of breath. Let's go. I didn't see this last time. How cute. You go up these little steps right here made out of rocks if you're going to go to the Vamonos Trail. That Vamonos Trail is a 0.75 trail. That's the shortest one they have here. So I've been on this hike twice before already and never noticed this little sign here that says wildlife only, stay on trail. So that tree up there is my favorite tree. I just think it's so cute how it sits on a rock and we'll be up there pretty soon but it seems like somebody's already enjoying it. So I was kind of in a hurry to leave the house because I wanted to get a good parking here and I forgot my hat or my visor, just something to cover the sun from hitting my face. But um, it's a beautiful day out here and I'm enjoying it very much. It is a little creepy hiking out here alone because as of now, I've only seen, I think like two people pass me up, but it's also very relaxing and quiet. Maybe because I'm so used to having somebody with me all the time. I don't know. But I brought my dog with me today. And so far, he's doing good. He was full of energy at the beginning and he's kind of slowing down right now. But he's doing good. So this is my favorite tree, you guys. There's a sign right there that wasn't there yesterday or Monday when I came here. I'm gonna go see what it says. Okay, it just says to keep off the tree to help us protect the lone oak by not climbing it. So I'm not planning on climbing it. I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy the view. I am sweating today. I don't know if it's because I don't have a hat on and the sun's like hitting me right on the face or what, but I am sweating. So I'm gonna give Odie some water right now because the poor thing is getting tired. He's pulling me too. So I brought this little collapsible bowl, see, and I'm going to pour some water in here for him. Odie, come here. Odie, come on. Here. Pour some water in there and give it to him. Here, Odie. Here, baby. So he had some water, he's full of energy again, and we're on our way. Alrighty, so the last hike I did was the blue arrow. We would go to the left. Today we're following the red arrow. We're going to the right. So I thought all the trails would be the same. But they're not. So every trail has a lot of different things to see. That's a good thing. All right, this is my view from this trail. If you guys can see, 
my favorite trees right over there. I've walked all that already. Oh man, this is beautiful. Alright, so if we were doing the Discovery 5 mile hike, we would be following that trail. That group of people right there, but today we're only doing the 2 mile. So we are going down this trail, but check out the views here, all these beautiful homes. This is beautiful down here. You having fun, Odie? Are you having fun? Very different from the three mile hike. A lot of different views. So when you're hiking up here and you see those little posts with the uh, arrows on them, you got to pay attention to them because I almost passed one up and it would have taken me to the five mile trail. And I definitely don't want to do the five mile trail today. So just pay attention to those posts and the color of the arrows so you go the right way. Whew. I've already completed two miles and this uh, trail is 2.2 so I think I'm going to be done pretty soon. I know Odie's going to be happy. So I ended back at the spot where we usually take the blue arrow or the red arrow down. So if I went up that way I'd go up to my favorite tree but I'm going to go back this way and it's going to take me exactly the way I started. And we're done. Oh, he did a great job. He was jumping on me for a little bit, wanting me to pick him up, but overall he did awesome. And there was a lot of people here today. I was very surprised. It's Thursday and a lot of people were hiking today. Alrighty, now we're just giving Odie some water, then heading back home. Hey guys, we are done with our hike. Today was the first time I ever hiked alone and Odie's first time ever hiking. Um, it was a beautiful day, a beautiful, beautiful hike. However, I am a little bit confused because the hike that I went on is called Lone Oak and it's supposed to be a 2.2 mile hike. And I have a app that is called uh, map my hike and so it maps everywhere I go and um, it told me I did a little bit over three miles like a 3.24 mile hike so this one's supposed to be 2.2 miles so I'm not sure how it works but I'm okay with it um, I'm hoping to do the five mile hike next time so it'll probably end up being my camera almost fell um, it'll probably end up being a six mile hike who knows either way I'm okay with it because I love it I love nature I love hiking and it's awesome so Odie's really tired he was jumping on me on their way down so I could carry him but I didn't so Odie say bye say bye hey Odie he really doesn't care right now do you care no no I think he just wants to sleep if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, 
subscribe and hit on that little notification bell so you guys can get notified every time I post a video like this one or any other one. See you guys next time. Bye. I think he's a little bit tired. Are you taking a nap, Odie? <laughs> Are you taking a nap? That was a long hike for you, huh, buddy? Long, long hike.